Hello, welcome to this screencast. Uh, in this screencast, I want to show you a really cool thing um, that I recently discovered on, on Wikipedia. Actually, like I knew that this um, sort of feature existed, but I never quite realized that it's actually a really nice thing um, to use. Um, and as, as you probably know, like on, on Wikipedia, you can, well, Wikipedia is, well, you know what Wikipedia is. And um, it, it features in a host's content, um, usually articles, um, sort of peer reviewed because many people can check it and um, can edit articles and uh, improve them and, and discuss the content, uh, etc. And uh, in order to do so, you can well, you can submit an article or create an article um, without an account, or you create an account. Um, what you see here, that's my account that I created for myself. My username is Orshiro, um, and the domain um, under which I can access this article is en.wikipedia.org slash wiki slash user. And then um, you have a colon, double colon, Orshiro. Um, that's a user page, and, and that's the feature I've been talking about that I, I find really cool that I've discovered it. Um, because basically, like, you know, many people think about, oh, um, I want my own internet website. I want to be present on, on, on the internet. And, and, and I used to think the same way. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I want to showcase and be what I'm doing and, and, and be reachable for people. Um, so I created my, my own website and had a lot of time invested into maintaining it and, and switching from one service provider like WordPress to GitHub pages and then to another one blot and la 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 and it all just costs time and but basically what I wanted was making my content accessible as easy as possible and to have it there for a long time um, and that's and that's what Wikipedia does I mean it's content on Wikipedia is kept um, in the public domain under a Creative Commons free license and and I and that's exactly what I wanted. I wanted my content to be available to people for free, so that they can do something with it. Um, so so what I what I did was, uh, well, I have my domain. So if you don't have a domain, you can think of buying a domain like GoDaddy, or there's so many different um, places where you can where you can register domains. My domain is orjana.de, and um, and what I did was I created a forward from or Jana de oh hang on w w w this one too much um as you can see like it's a forward from my domain let's take that one away to the wikipedia page so basically now each time someone enters my domain name i can give my domain name to someone um that person is then forwarded to my wikipedia page and um and, and so so what I want to do in the future now is kind of, you know, take a little bit of time to, to to fully create. This is just the first draft of my of my Wikipedia page, but just because I was so excited. Oh yeah, I found a really cool new feature. Um, so so I will probably create my 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 first page on the on the Wikipedia. You can even create sub pages. So if let's say um, if I have a project idea, um, like project one then I can just append this to my URL and Wikipedia will tell me this page doesn't exist yet in my user space, but I could start the page uh, by clicking here and just create that sub page of my project page. So in that sense, you can build your own personal encyclopedia uh, on Wikipedia and it's all for free. And as long as you adhere to some guidelines, like you know, it, it should be content that is not violating any, any state state law um, or in other way be harmful to people reading it um, you're free to do whatever you want on wikipedia and um, collaboration is easy people can edit and and talk about your pages so to conclude and that's kind of the message i want to leave you with um, wikipedia is a really powerful tool a free tool, of course, donations to Wikipedia are appreciated, but a free, essentially a free tool um, to very quickly set up your content and make clear to people that 
what you're doing um, is beneficial um, to the public domain because you're doing you're offering your content for free and um, if you want you can leave a note like what I what I'm trying to do that you know I, I try to make a living with the work for the comments that I, I I don't have any financial interest in the things I'm doing but still in in some ways I need to live um, and, and make a little bit of money um, so you could add a, a donation note that that you welcome donation um, to help you support your work so um, yeah, I'm, I'm quite curious if, if you if you have some good user pages that you want to showcase or your own user page, just leave a comment and um, I'm, I'm, I'm really happy to discuss that um, approach further with you in the comment section. So please leave a comment and uh, see you at the next see you at the next screencast. Bye. -bye.